are the royal priesthood. You are a kingly nation. Amen? You are the royal priesthood. You are a kingly nation. As in, wakati wana sema, Jesus Christ is the king of kings. Wana manisha, is the king of kings. So manisha, all of you that are sitting here are kings and queens. Amen? Amen? So even how you carry out yourself in the world, how you walk into rooms and offices of people, how you walk into different commitments that you meet. Remember, you're a king, amen? So everything you handle, you handle as a king, amen? Akisama, you're a royal priest. You are a royal priest. You are a royal priest. You are a Jew. There's a reason why I look at your authority, amen? Akisama, I've given you authority. I've given you do- dominion. The one that will speak for everything that you want it into existence, amen? So whatever situation you may be in, whatever you're walking into, whatever you're going through in your family, handle it as a king, amen? A king handles things with wisdom, amen? So let me look at it. Let me look at it. Let me look at it. Let me show up with the different pictures, with the different um, worship services. Worship like a king, amen? There's a difference that a civilian would worship, but there's a way a king would worship, amen? Because you know what you're worshiping, amen? Praise God. Praise God. Say, I am a king. Say, I am a king. I am a king. Say, confidence. I am a king. I am a king. I am a king. Say, confidence. Say, I am a king. I am a king. Praise God. So whatever you walk into, handle it as a king, amen? Kuna mtu kwa usha go flat is kwa sema sema nini japa na tajajina yako mape usijaribu You're dealing with a king Praise God You're dealing with a king, amen? Yeah. There's a reason the Bible calls you a royal priesthood A chosen nation, a chosen generation Kumanisha, whenever you're walking in Mungu anawana anawana a reflection of who God is And not only a reflection, whatever light na meka na niyako Whatever light I may shine forth from you, I mean, and speak within you, and as a man, this word divides bone and marrow. Amen? Amen. Whatever word is speaks within you, woman, who can give my love to say, hey, will it be she not be free? Amen? I don't think of the book of my, it is for the people to be she knew. Will it be she knew? Amen? Amen. Will it be she knew? So don't, don't let anyone break you down. We still have a job with this shit. Amen? Amen. Amen. You're a king, amen? amen? Whatever situations rise up against you, know, no, you do not know who you're dealing with. You're dealing with a king, amen? amen. When you're worshiping, when you're worshiping, you're brought the king of kings. You're brought the king of kings from the perspective of you're not worshiping the king of kings. I myself, I am a king, amen? Amen? amen. 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 That shows you not easily the word down. What is it? What is it? That was a powerful, powerful encouragement. Yeah. Not just anybody. You are not just a nobody. In fact, you are not a nobody. You are a royal seed. You are a king. So when you get into a place, you get into that place like a king. Like the king that you are. When I walk into an interview room, I don't walk inside there like any other person. I walk like the king that I am. And I told you, when you know who you are, it doesn't matter whether you are late, it doesn't matter whether there are people who are more qualified than you. When you get inside there, you know what you can get program in Arabic. When you are in here, you can get program in Arabic. Because if you are in here, things must change. I pray that whenever you get into a place, God will put an anointing upon you that will make things to change. Because we are not normal. We are 